All right, welcome back to the channel, everybody, and to episode three of No One Survived. In this episode, we need to finish the looting that we started over in the farming kind of base over there. And I want to go check out this little, uh, where is it at? This little spot here kind of looks like a, uh, I don't know, like a little cul-de-sac of houses, maybe? So I thought that'd be pretty cool to check out. But before we do that, uh, we are going to be doing some massive looting, and I don't think these two boxes are going to be enough. And before we get all of these filled up, I want to add some racks so we can add more storage boxes to this. But in order to do the storage racks, we got to go into our technology tab. And we got to opt in for this wooden box frame, which requires three boards. So let's head in here and let's grab... Uh, let's just grab a stack of five. That'll work. Go back into our technology and let's learn the box frame. And I also would like to opt in for the rainwater collector. And we need nine sticks. Do we have... Oh, uh, we have almost just enough. So with that, we should be able to also build a rainwater collector. You know, that would be great if we decide to build a base kind of in the middle of the map. Okay, with that built, let's see, where do we want to put... And actually, how do we build... Is that in here? No, we should be able to build... Oh, how do we build the collector? Or the, uh, the racks? Ah, furniture a bit. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we've got a log frame, we've got the stick rack, and we've got a board frame. I believe the board frame... Is that the... Oh, no, there it is. Yeah, the wooden box frame. So that would be five boards and two simple parts. And I think that's what we'll go with. Alright, so where do we want to put this one at. Yeah, right against the wall. That's actually not too bad. Could put one here. And probably put one there. Yeah, I think that would work. Alright, let's see. Can we take out everything that is in this box? Do we have enough space? Oh yeah, we should have enough space. All right, now let's tear this thing apart. So we get out the wooden hammer, we can tear down, and we will get all the materials back for that. Perfect. And now let's build another one of those boxes. Gotta take the hammer out. And see, now the box can go right there. Or we can, you know, mouse wheel and pick which one we want to set it to. So let's put one there. And we'll put one there. Can we put one on the top? Oh, it looks like that kind of sticks through the uh, through the roof. Yeah, we'll do... Okay, we can't build that one yet until we get that box out, but that's fine. Let's add all the materials in there. Let's transfer over everything that we don't need on us. Alright, so we got those taken care of. They're all installed. Got everything transferred over, at least into these two. And now we've got an extra two more for the looting that hopefully we will get today. Uh, so let's go and finish off uh, the looting over in this area. We'll grab everything, bring it back. Uh, I believe there's still some more food in here, which we're going to need because our protein is starting to get kind of low. So let's, uh, let's take a peek and see what we got in here. And let's sneak under that thing again. Let's see, did the zombies come back? Uh, they might have. Yep, I see one over there. That should really be, I believe, it. Yeah, let's go take him out so he doesn't bother us later. Is he trying to beat up the uh, the tree? What are you doing? Man, I love this spear. Alright, let's head into this one. I think this was one of the ones that still had a lot of stuff left in here. Alright, let's go into these. I think this is where we had a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, so a bunch of toolboxes. 
grab grab the fuel for now. We could always bring that back with us and have one chest just for fuel. Okay, look at all that. The plastics. Grab the wires. Might as well grab. And look at that. We are full already. And this stuff is just huge. That's what she said. That's what she said. That's what she said. Yeah, I think. Man, look at that. And we're heavy. What do we have in here? Even more stuff. All right. Uh, so let's drop off some of the stuff that we're just probably not going to need immediately. Like these motors, we're not going to need. Could always come back for the fuel if needed at another time. Because really, I want the simple parts. Is definitely more important. All right, so we finished looting that area, and we got a few toolboxes, some barrel of food or barrel of fuel. Another pot, and a few just miscellaneous things. Uh, there's still a crap ton of, like, seeds and all that, but I don't think we're at a point where we need that right now, so... I'm super excited to go check out this area, mostly because we need the food. So if we just run right down this road, we should run right into it, so... Let's go around the lake. Oh, before I do that, I want to sh show you my idea, which might fail horribly, but we'll see. So we've got these little places here. I'm curious if the zombies would be able to climb up this back, and if not, they might be forced to come straight through here. And I believe, let me try this. Let's go, it's going to be outdoor. Yeah, so can we... We could put up a bunch of spikes all the way around the front and around this thing and use this as our first horde night or our first horde so this is what I'm thinking I don't know how it's going to work if it's going to work at all uh, it looks like yeah we could put some underneath there kind of protect us and it was it's a shame that we couldn't put it like in this aisle kind of like right through the center yeah, I couldn't do that, but we could pop it, like, right, where was it? Yeah, like, right here, and then here, and then around, and around, and do that to kind of protect us. Uh, there's also this cool little uh, shed over here. Yeah, kind of right in through here. I mean, this is pretty stout, and I don't think you can break it. I could be wrong, but... We could also maybe see about, uh, you know, putting spikes around this one. And then, of course, you have that, but there's no stairs up to this one. But, yeah, that's the idea that I have. Uh, what do you guys think? Do you think it's going to work, or is it going to, you know, fail horribly? Let me know. I'm curious. All right, let's go and head over. Do we want to check out this barn? You know, we're already here. We're going to be... Running down that way. You know what? No, we'll hit this barn up on the way back. Because really, we need to find food. Because we are getting pretty low on the protein. But let's head up over here and see what these houses have for us. Alright, I think we made it. Yeah, we made it to this area. So this is like another farm. But it has a whole lot of buildings around it. So this looks cool. It's got a bunch of cabins and all that. Uh, luckily, on our way here, um, I ran across a, another vehicle along the road, and it had some food in there for us, so at least we got a little bit more protein in there. Uh, I'm kind of leaving the gasoline and all that for now, so we're still a decent amount away. Ooh, yep, yeah, we'll take that. We're still a decent uh, time away before we got a car up and running. But let's start looting this area. Uh, I think I want to end with the cabin over there, or with the big farm. What do we have over here? So, I think we'll just start with this house up here. Well, maybe we'll actually start with the, uh, with the car first. Let's see if we have anything. A t-shirt. Oh, and gloves. We could always wear gloves. Gloves are good to have. 
And the shirt... Uh, what do we have actually for a shirt right now? So plus 15, plus 5. Uh, you know what, let's uh... Let's wear... Let's wear this, shall we? Yeah, there we go. We'll just throw this down on the ground. Hey, now our guy actually has a t-shirt instead of the tank top. Perfect. Let's take a look up under the hood. Uh, okay, a few more blocks. Nice, useful. Alright, now how the heck do we get into this place? Spears at the ready. You gonna leave me alone? Alright, cool. Thank you. Yep, you go that way. Alright, first house. Actually, I think this is the first house of the uh, season. Uh, let's hop in. Take a look and see. What do we have? I hear somebody. Ah, he's outside. Shall we invite him in? Morning, buddy. Oh, you're quick. Come here. Yeah, got him. Get into the rhythm. We get him? Ah, uh, we got him. Alright, and we got some fabric. Oh, yeah, we got lots to loot. Alright, let's get to looting. See what we can find. Look at that, a couple winter hats and some cotton trousers. Oh, that looks a little bit better. Let's see what we got. So for pants, we have a 15, a 20, and a 20. This is a 18, 45, and a 20. Oh, heck yeah. We are going to take those for sure and equip it. Yeah, look at our guy. Those are, those are kind of some fashionable jeans there. Sweet, I like it. I think we just got one more thing to uh, search in here. So a rifle stock and a sniper rifle stock. Alright, now that should be everything in this house. Do we have a backyard? Anything back here? Like, what is this? Oh, it's a uh, soccer field. Is that what this is? Yeah, it's a soccer field. It's kind of cool. You know, this wouldn't make too bad for a potential uh, horde area either. I mean, it's completely surrounded, but I want to say that the zombies can actually jump that fence. Uh, but maybe if we put uh, spikes all the way around it, kind of protect that in. That'd make for a great, like, large group base. All right, so first house down. Let's go take a look at the, uh, the second house over here. Ooh, M4A1. Yes, we will take it. And that uses 556, five, which we haven't gotten any as of yet, but that is a start. At least we've got a nice little rifle. Let's go into house number two and see what we can find in here. We'll start in the bathroom and kind of work our way around the house. Ooh, a couple backpacks. That. Oh, we did not bring our... So we got to make a car. If we can make a car, we can throw these in a cart. You could do some cool stuff about, like, loading all of this into a backpack and then throwing the backpack into the cart. It's kind of a cool, you know, cheesy little way to get extra storage. Maybe we'll do that after this loot run. By the end of the episode, we will make ourselves a cart that we can use to uh, haul around with us. All right, let's finish looting. House number two, done. Uh, got a few things. We are starting to get full already. Can't believe that. Oh, and look, we have a visitor. What's up, buddy? I know, I'm, I'm, I'm taking some of your stuff in here. 
but I don't think you're going to be using it anytime soon. Get down. Come on, back up. Back up, there you go. And back down you go. Oh, we got a little bit of something. Ooh. Uh, you know, we're almost full, so let's go do this stuff and see if there's anything good in here. Oh, yeah, we got some fabric, more simple parts. Another lockpick tool. We're full on that. Yep, we are definitely getting full. Let's see what do we got in here. We might be coming back to this spot. Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Hello, ma'am. Yep, I'm coming to say hi. Let's go. Hey, there we go. No useful items. And we can't do anything there. Alright, so we've done... Let's see, that house. That house. I believe we're on here, but man, we are full already. You know, let's, uh... Let's take a peek and see what would it make to... Or what would it take to actually be able to build... The cart. And I believe that is... Is that in this? Yeah, there we go, the hand cart. So we need 15 boards and 8 simple parts. We should be able to build that. You know? I think that's what we're going to do. We are basically full already. Let's head back, drop the stuff off, build a cart, and then let's come back and finish looting uh, this little, uh, little cul-de-sac area. Alright, we mid back. Let's drop off kind of what we have. Uh, let's see. Is there anything we can throw in here that we already have? Yeah, let's uh let's unload everything. Alright, so got everything unloaded, and I think we have what we need in order to make the cart, which would be 15 boards and 8 parts. I believe we should have that. Uh, let's see, at all. Sweet deal. So now the cool thing with this is you've got all of this storage that you can do, and we could pick up those backpacks. We could put a bunch of stuff in the backpacks and then throw them into the cart and then also fill in around the cart. So that is actually really cool. So we could keep our, uh, you know, the stuff that we're not going to plan on using uh, kind of in here. And actually, you know, we have we already have an iron pickaxe on us, so we can throw this back into the storage. I didn't realize we had one on us already. All right, so we're back in here now. I'm trying to remember where the backpacks were. Were they in the second house? Or were they in this car? I cannot remember. I mean, I, I doubt it be in the engine bay. Let me just double check. Nope. I, I think it was in this house. So, we hit F. That will drop the cart. And let's see. Was it in this house? I want to say... In this? Yeah, it was in here. So, what we can do... Where'd that backpack go? Did I just drop it somewhere? Oh, there it is. Sweet. So, oh, we can't pick it up. But what I think we can do is hold it like this. And figure out how to get out of the house again. So it's kind of weird, but you can, like, drag it out of the house. And then we can put it right next to here. And if we use this, it shows that it's on the ground. And pop! We can pop it right in there. Okay, so now that we have our bag, let's, uh... Let's get this on us, and let's go over to the second house. We will do some looting. Or, sorry, the third house. We'll do some looting and see what type of stuff that we can get out of here. So we'll drop the cart. And let's go collect up a bunch of stuff, shall we? Wow, can you believe that? 
all of those and nothing. Not a single thing in there. Alright, well for the most part, this house was kind of a bust on that, to be honest. Not a whole lot in there. Alright, let's uh, let's drop off what we got. Alright, let's see what this house has in store for us. Look at him sneaking up on us. Right when we were trying to take out a backpack. Come here, big boy. Alright, so this was cool. We got another big backpack in there. So that in here, that will be excellent to have. Sweet. And you know what? I want to try something. Can we bring this, just kind of bring this in with us? And then can I go... Hey, there we go. Yeah, I think we'll just bring the card in with us and then we can just drag stuff over into it. I mean, it's not the most, like, realistic, but, hey, it works. Hey, come here, you. You're just about to head home, too. Yeah, let's try the axe. How's the axe work? Oh, axe works pretty good. Very cool. Alright, so we're gonna have to probably come back to this. There's still a few things in here, like some boxes and stuff, but I've got like every backpack just full of stuff right now. So I think that was a pretty good loot run. So uh, let's head back and unload. Alright, we made it back. I finally got everything unloaded. I had to actually make to a uh, another shelf for two more boxes, which those two got filled up with everything, but we're, I mean, it's a horrible chaotic mess right now, uh, but we are full of magazines and things and fuel and all types of stuff. So all in all, I thought that was a pretty good loot run. Um, and you know, no, know what I was just thinking? You know what we never added? We never added ourselves a door. Uh, where is our door? There we go. Yep. We did never, never do that. So we need four boards. I want to say I actually might have four in here. Oh, are you serious? I have one short. We're one short. All right, I'm going to grab that final board and finish that thing off real quick. There's no way we're finishing this uh, episode without having a door. All right, last board. Sweet, now we have a door. Yeah, I wonder if I could have changed the way that opened. Oh, well, that's fine. We'll deal with it. All right, let's get this bad boy out here. Get him parked outside. It's not in the middle of our way. Alright, so I thought that was a pretty good looting day. Um, we, I think we'll end the episode off there. Uh, next episode, we've got to start working on the horde stuff. Uh, because it is day 6 at, what, 4.38 in the afternoon? So tomorrow is going to be the day when we have our first horde. So we'll need to go out, probably collect some ammo. Uh, we'll maybe try a little bit more looting over at this, uh, where the heck was that at? A little barn over here and maybe we'll take a trip down to the merchant uh, because it should go pretty quick to put up some spikes around there but we'll probably just have to grab a bunch of wood so tomorrow's gonna be a hectic day so hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode if you did make sure you comment down below and uh, let me know how your guys's adventure is going in the game if you happen to be playing it so until I see you guys tomorrow take it easy all right and make sure to keep it simple Bye, everybody. Let's go watch. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign. A sign.
want to be the greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fake.